Hello, Pixels! Welcome back to Animal Crossing New Leaf. We got a visitor. Ah, hello, the Mayor. I've got a delivery for you. I've already put it in your mailbox, so be sure to check it later. When your mailbox is full, I can't cram any more in there, so don't forget to collect your mail, okay? When you have mail, you'll see a blinking sign like you see now. That's how you'll know. Well, I don't know how cardboard does that. Well, I gotta get moving. I'll see you later. Alright, see you later. Shoo, 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 shoo. Alright, Pixels, let's check out our mail. We got one letter. Yes, somebody loves us. Alright, our letter is from an unknown sender. To Ellie, congrats on your newfound mayorhood. To be honest, I was supposed to become the mayor, but one thing led to another. And now it's all up to you. I'm rooting for you. Keep it a secret. Alright, somehow this person knows my address, knows where I live, and suddenly is okay with me taking his mayor position. Okay, let's head to town hall and meet up with Fower Isabel. Hey, Isabel. Oh, Mayor Elliot. Have you settled in and finished unpacking? Mmm, all done, I guess. Wow, really? You must be really efficient when it comes to moving. My bedroom is completely full of unpacked cardboard boxes, and it feels like I moved so long ago. Sorry, please don't tell my brother. I don't let him into my room for just this reason. Ahem. <laughs> right. I was going to tell you about the town hall. For starters, right now I'm standing at the service counter. This is the information hub of Pixel. I provide a variety of services at the service counter, such as giving people advice for living in town. I also listen to requests to change the town tune and flag, and I report on citizen satisfaction. However, to get advice or provide input, you'll need to stand at the counter just like everybody else. Where you're standing now is perfect, actually. Now then, moving on to responsibilities as mit- I almost forgot! Before you can start laying out your vision for Pixel, you'll need a town development permit. Getting the permit takes a bit of work, but don't worry, I'll help you out, that's what I'm here for. You sound pretty busy. Me? Busy? Don't worry about it, I got a whole hour of sleep last night, so I'm just worried to go. Oh, poor Isabel. Now then, there's a very special chair in the back of this room that's reserved for the mayor. That's you! When you need to work on official mayoral business, just sit in that chair and I'll help you out. And come see me when I'm not overly busy so we can get started on your town development permit. I feel so sorry for Isabel, she worked so hard, even when we just started. Aww. Hi Mayor Elliot, let me guess, you'd like to work on the application for your town development permit. Well then, let me explain the prerequisites for the permit. The first requirement is that you own a house in town. You're still living in a tent, so you need to put together the down payment for a house first. Okay, the second requirement for the town development permit is to gain the approval of the citizens. In order to gauge citizen approval, I'll regularly survey the town's folks to see what they think of you. The best way to raise your approval rating is to improve the town and the lives of those who live here. Now, according to a preliminary survey, your current approval rating is 10%. The law requires that all applicants have a 100% approval rating, so let's make that our goal. Talk to me from your mayor's chair anytime you want to know what your approval rating is. I can also give you advice on how to raise your approval rating. That's all there is to it. Good luck, Mayor Elliot. Wow, I don't understand how Isabel can talk so much. It's such a mouthful, all the time. So, 10%, that's great. That's awesome. So, to raise it up, we need to first, let's go check on our house. Let's go to Nuke's place, see what's going on. And it's closed. It's 9 o'clock, fortunately. Sorry. So, what's a better way of approval ratings than meeting the new villagers? Oh, we got a monkey. Hey, Mr. Mayor. I'm Flip. My hobby is training my bod. Mayors need plenty of physical stamina, right? If I were you, I'd train like crazy, Rack. Oh, Elliot. What you need now, Rack? Talk to me. A lot of people don't notice, but mayors need to be really buff, like superhero buff. You're really lucky to have me here giving you pointers about all the physical demands of mayorhood. I'm happy to be kind of as a buff as advisor to your honor, but yeah, I honestly don't know everything. But I'll tell you what, Reback, when I get stuck, I go to the town hall and check in with Isabel. She can give you lots of great advice about life, Rarak. Oh, that's an odd phrase, Rarak. Rarak. Morak. I'm also lame at rhyming. <laughs> All right, our second villager. Let's meet him or her. Oh, we got a little chipmunk squirrel. Hey, Mayor. 
It's me, Ricky. It's kind of stiff and formal to call you mayor, so I'm just gonna call you Elliot, all right? We're all counting on you to do your best, not case. You call me a what? Yo, Elliot, what you want? Not case. I don't like how you're saying that, but can we talk, though? Hey, you bought a house, right? Now you just gotta start filling it up with cool new stuff. If you need necessities or furniture, go to Nuclean Junction or Able Sisters to find clothes. There are fun places and shops since their stock changes on a daily basis. You should check them out. Alright, thanks on that advice and pushing me out of the way. I want to play your guitar for a bit. Ah, Animal Crossing, where you can become a great guitar player just by pressing A a lot. Oh wait, what's this? Are we getting a new villager soon? Puddles? Can't wait to meet her or him or whoever it is. Oh, would you look at that? Our tree is growing. I'm happy as a clam if I can do expressions. Another villager, huh? We haven't met yet, have we? Well, not formally anyway, but I know who you are, Mayor. Remember your first day here in Pixel? I was here when you arrived. It was quite an event. Our town has already gotten lovelier since then. You're having a wonderful effect on our town. My name is Kitty, and I look forward to seeing what you're going to do with Pixel. What can I do for you, Elliot? Meow. Huh. Okay, that's a good phrase, I guess, but can we talk? Ever heard that saying, spending money like it grows on trees? In our town, you can. Shake a cherry tree and then carry the fruit to the recycling shop. You can sell it there. To shake a tree, face it, and shake it. To pick up things on the ground, just do it. Oh, you'll find shells on the beach you can sell too. Nature is so amazing. Wow. Alright, let's find another one. Oh, wait, who's this over here? Sahara? I'm called Hasara. That's for us, my name. I come from far away. Maybe I change your carpet. Wallpaper too is 3,000 bells for deal, but ah, your home is a tent. This is no good for me, very no good. I cannot help your tent. So sorry now. Let's talk later, perhaps, when your house is bigger. Yes, okay. So apparently, since we have a tent, Sahara, Sahara Zarala can't change our wallpapers and carpet. I don't think we even have money anyway. Yeah, we're broke. We're very broke. Very, very broke. Very bad. Oh, found another villager. Oh, Chevre. Mayor, I'd like to formally welcome you to Pixel. My name is Chevre. May I call you Elliot? I hope to become good friends, Elliot. But I know you're probably eager to get started with your new duties, so I'll leave you to it. See you soon. Oh, not really. Hi, Elliot. What can I do for you, Laba? Hmm, <laughs> that's pretty nice. I'm bored. Over time, you'll wind up with a lot of things you don't need anymore. Anytime you want to pare down, just pay a visit to retail, the recycling shop in town. They'll buy anything from furniture to clothing to fish to fruit. Their prices are pretty good, too. Thanks for the advice, Chevrolet. I'll keep in mind on that. These villagers are very helpful. Oh, retail is closed, sadly. Retail is unfortunately closed, so we can't go in there. And when I meant 9 earlier, I meant 10. And when I mean 10 now, it's 11, and it's 11, so it's closed. Eh, time is so confusing these days. Whoa, 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 did we fall in a pitfall? Oh, dang. That's cruel. We're missing one more villager. Apparently, that's Alfonso. I think he was the alligator guy we saw before. Let's see if he's home. I'm sleeping. Please don't wake me up, okay? It's only 11 o'clock. I mean, that's not a problem, right? <laughs> I need help really bad. All right, Isabel, I met everybody. What's the approval rating right now? Hi, Mr. Mayor. Is there something I can help you with? Sure, the development permit. Our approval rating is only 23%. Why don't you begin by paying the down payment on your house? Well, if Nuke is open... Come on! But at least meeting everybody got us a easy, cool 13%. Well, you know what? We'll just wait here until tomorrow morning or afternoon and then finally meet Nuke. Pay for our house, get it built, and then we'll have a good old time. I'll catch you next time, Pixels, in Animal Crossing New Leaf. Leaf filler. Catch you next time, Pixels.